Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. It is a nice, lazy Sunday afternoon, and the arena, Purgatory, and Daredevil Hell's Kitchen is over, round one. I did not go for Purgatory, I just went for Shards, and of course I got the uh, four star. That's what I usually do round one. Round two, I plan to go for the five star Purgatory not the six star. Uh, and I did something, uh, this arena that I hadn't done in the previous arenas. And I'll talk about that when we get there. All right. So let's take a look here. All right. So I got the shards and apparently I put up too much and ended up getting the five star daredevils hell's kitchen. Uh, wasn't planning to do that. Uh, but you'll see the score I put up. Um, I put up the same score in both of these arenas. It was, a uh, yeah. Now, this one here, the Summoner Trials. Let's go in here. I put up 4.1 million. Now, let me explain why I put up 4.1 million. All right, and I'll go through the uh, leaderboards as I'm explaining it. So, this arena was supposed to be changed. Kabam messed up. Uh, they've already made a post saying that um, this is still the old arena and they will be giving out compensation, but they've been a little quiet on the criteria. All right. We don't have any insider information in the CCP, uh, cause we asked them and they basically told us the same thing that they told you. That is the official statement. Now, one of the things that they said in that statement, uh, got me to thinking it said you will get you know, uh, compensated based on your output. Now, the question we had was, all right, the new milestone was supposed to be 4.4 million. This arena is still the 2.1 arena. And we wanted to know if we put in 2.1, just get the milestones, will we get compensated and get all the units that we would have gotten if this had been the right arena? We did not get an answer to that. So at first, I was just going to do the milestones. And then last minute, I decided, let me see if I can try to get the 4.4. As you can see, I could not. Uh, I went right down uh, to the wire. Okay, I'm going to show you guys. You can see right there. You know, I didn't even have the continue. I mean, all I had was the continue button. I didn't have the next fight or next series or anything like that. Okay. All right. So, uh, I was doing it right up until, you know, it was over and I was able to get 4.1. Uh, I had a slight miscalculation and I got my four stars on cooldown a little bit too late. So they were not going to be ready until about one o'clock. All right. Too late to use them to get any points. Uh, certainly not as much as I would have needed to get 4.4. Uh, so what I ended up doing when I saw that, because I didn't realize it at first, uh, when I saw that, I said, oh, let me start boosting. Well, I had already used all my max, uh, maxed out four stars and most of my 440s. So I started boosting uh, my 440s, used all of my 440s, and then I was like, well, I'm not going to make it to 4.4, but let me try to go as high as I can go. So I started using my three stars and I had a bunch of boosts and there was an item use on uh, event on. So perfect. I haven't been using them because with the new arenas, no reason uh, to really boost up my three stars. Coat hanger. I wasn't expecting to see your name over here. Congratulations. All right. Now, I think like with Coat Hanger, uh, with myself, I think the reason that we're on these leaderboards is because of what I just mentioned. We're trying to, you know, hedge our bets. You know, Kabam hasn't said anything. We don't have any information, but, you know, just in case. Um, and since I didn't get the 4.4, Maybe if they're going to, you know, go by whatever milestone you got here, get everything that you would get 
in the other arena. If they're going to do it that way, which, you know, it's probably a little bit more work for them, but uh, it's definitely fair. Uh, there he goes. Um, then I won't get the very, very top one, maybe, but I should get all the others. So I should get some uh, units. Uh, but next uh, arena, uh, starting tomorrow, uh, we'll have this arena fixed. And it'll be the 4.4, .4, uh, and then we don't have to worry about anything. But yeah, uh, Skull Forger, congratulations there. Uh, are you doing the same thing that we're doing, hedging our bets? All right, so... That's it for uh, this arena. That's what was going on there. That's why I put up uh, the 4.1 million. Uh, and I tried to put up the 4.4, but, you know, miscalculation. All right. So there's the score. 25.2 million. And like I said, I put the same amount in the other arena. I was thinking that that was too much. Uh, remember, these arenas are the new ones with the new milestones. And so I expect this to be much lower, but I didn't know how low. And it wasn't too much effort for me to put in 25 million. So I just went ahead and uh, put it in anyway. And it was too much. Uh, Dahish, congratulations. Uh, rank 15, not bad at all. Um, so I'll, I'll try to get some input on uh, what people were putting up. You know, maybe we'll find a, a good cutoff and that'll make things a lot easier for me. Months behind. Congratulations, my friend. All right. So uh, these guys, by the way, uh, everyone top 100 got the six star Daredevil's Hell's Kitchen. All right. And uh, hopefully everybody that went for him that I know uh, got him. But we will see. We'll be seeing some names. But um, I don't know when I'm going to go for the six star. You guys let me know what the uh, cutoff was. I'll, I'll find out. Uh, but what score did you guys put up uh, to get your, your rankings? And if I miss your name, let me know in the comments. Uh, if your name is different from your YouTube name, that's harder for me. All right. Um, I have a, a really hard time remembering names at the best of times. And if you have a name, basically two names, I not only have to remember both names, but I have to remember that they're the same person as well. Uh, I've done that in a couple of cases. It just takes me a little bit longer. Um, and if you're regularly on the leaderboards, it'll be easier. Uh, just keep on hitting me on the comment section, letting me know, yep, you know, I was ranked so-and-so. You know, uh, Sadmio, congratulations. Haven't seen you in a while, man. All right. Let's see. All right. So uh, this guy here, Kiwis, I am sorry. 101 is never a good place to be. Uh, I don't know whether to congratulate most of the people on the leaderboards, but 101 was going for the six-star champion. I know that. So you can definitely get my condolences. All right. Um, but the rest of these guys here, they may have been going for the six-star. They may have been doing a casual grind. Um, they may have just been putting up whatever they could put up to get the four-star. I don't know. Uh, so congratulations to those who got the champion that they wanted and condolences for anyone that did not. I think that's a good way to do it because I don't know. I don't know who's going for what now. So congratulatory, uh, you know, comments, blah, blah, blah. Uh, let me know in the comments below, uh, so that I can give you, you know, a direct and personal congratulations or, uh, condolence. Uh, so, all right, and that is it for the uh, top 200 leaderboards. 201 to 500 also got the five star. If you're one of those, let me know in the comments, all right? Now, for the final one, we've got 
Purgatory. Now, the four star, which is what I always go for in round one, we got as a milestone, which I love because we had a um, level up and we had a mystic advancement. Now, mystic advancement didn't happen at the same time as the level up. It would have been perfect, but it happened afterwards. But I still managed to get it because I had the three star and the four star unawakened purgatory. And I had awakening gems and I had a bunch of mystic sig stones. I rocked that event. Okay. Um, definitely got the one to 10%. All right, let's see. Hopefully I didn't miss anybody. Okay. Wait, what? Wow. <laughs> Dare you catch me. Okay. All right. I see you. I see you. Number one. I got you. All right. Let's see who we got. Duke Gecko. Congratulations, man. On that six star purgatory. Now, Everything that I've heard, uh, Rim in the Rock, congratulations, man. Everything that I've heard about Purgatory uh, and Scene is that she's okay. You know, she's not meme tier or anything like that, um, but she has some awesome animations. I mean, her animations are, are, are out of this world, okay? Uh, I love her animations. And... Uh, of course, I want to get her because I don't have her. Uh, not going to be trying to get the five, uh, the six star. Uh, right now, for a new six star champion, you're going to have to refresh. Uh, even guys that have uh, much larger rosters than I do end up having to refresh or miss the champion. All right, so that just seems to be the new meta. Uh, new champion, even if they're not uh, very good. Um, Black Gamer, congratulations. Uh, you, you end up having to, uh, refresh. Now, uh, something else about the, um, the arenas in the basic arena, six star champions are supposed to give the same amount of points as the five stars. That didn't happen. So not only did we have the old, um, milestones and an arena for summoner trials they updated the milestones for the basic arena but they didn't update the scoring so that should be fixed next um arena which is uh tomorrow all right so that's the top 100 here who got the six star and now Sweet potato, I know you are not feeling very sweet now. That is rough. You have my condolences. All right, let's see who else. <laughs> ah, some of these names. Um, let's see if we see anybody that we recognize here. And again, just what I said is the same as the other arena. Congratulations to those who got the champion that they were going for. And my condolences for those who uh, didn't get the champion they were going for, but perhaps still got, you know, the five-star version. You know, that might still be, you know, it's a consolation prize, but that's something that, you know, at least you're not going away empty-handed, you know? Uh, that was one th thing that, um, uh, that I did like, that if you went for the six-star and you missed it, you still got the five star if you didn't already have the five star. So you got something. Pedro, congratulations or condolences. Uh, but uh, Coat Hanger, I don't know if you were going for the five star or the six star. Congratulations if you were going for the five star. My condolences if you were not. All right. Let's see who else we got here. Um, but yeah, so this arena wasn't uh uh up to snuff it wasn't what it was supposed to be maniac shout out my brother congrats condolences let me know in the comments man uh let's see and ben riley now i was talking earlier about someone whose youtube name was different from their in-game name ben riley is one of them and i learned his name but then I forgot his YouTube name. Yeah, anyway, uh, that's how it goes sometimes. 
All right, so that is it. Mirir. I don't know. Congrats, condolences, uh, how much of a grind you put up. Uh, but that's going to do it, guys. Uh, 201 to 500. Congratulations on getting that five star. I'll assume that you guys did want to get the five star. Uh, let me know in the comments below what score you put up. Uh, give us an idea of the uh, cutoffs. And uh, I will be going for Purgatory next round as a five star. Not ready to go for any six stars, especially not six star new uh, champs. Uh, if I'm going to go for a six star, it's going to most likely be a basic champion first, unless in the featured arena, it's an old champion that I don't have that no one else wants. Otherwise, I'm not going to try to put up a crazy score. Uh, it would take me uh, quite a few units. And we have July 4 coming up. So I'm not trying to spend any units. I'm trying to hold on to my units right now and earn as much as I can. All right. So take care. Uh, and I hope you all have a blessed day.